Good morning, my wonderful people. Greetings to you all in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. Please, are you one of those people that always says there is nothing like dream? That dream cannot help. So you want to tell me that God can make a mistake. You know something past God that created you. Everything God created has a purpose. And that he knows the reason why he make a provision of dream. Just watch. Go through your Bible from Genesis to Revelation. You see every successful great man in the Bible. God visited them through the, their dreams. God visited them through their dreams. Dreams have life. Dreams connected physical. It has something to do with physical. Some people, their problem used to stop through dreams. Some people used to die through dreams. When they kill that person in the dream, they die physical. Some people used to succeed through dreams. Some people used to receive their healing through dreams. Don't be one of them that are trying to say, God, don't know what he did. Please, come out here and drop your dream. What you need is understanding and the interpretation to your dream. It can make your journey so faster and easy. Thank you. Please, today's topic is for those who they dream, they see mango, number one mango. That number one mango is that green mango. Even though the mango ripe, you will see it is you it, it will still greenish. Number one mango. If you are dreaming of seeing number one mango in your dream, what is the meaning of that mango tree and the fruit? Just come close and put your ear. This message, this interpretation must touch your life. It will heal. A lot of people have been dreaming of this mango tree, but they don't understand it. I mean number one mango, number one mango, number one mango. The one that even though it's ripe, it will still what? Green. The tall mango. Did you dream of seeing that mango and the tree? You see a lot of mango on top of that tree. And the breeze blow that mango and the mango fall fall from that tree and you pick that mango on top of that the head of that mango the fruit i mean the fruit you now see something like gum gum dropping from the head hallelujah what type of sickness are you passing through did you have any, a heart attack or high bp cholesterol what type of sickness are you experiencing? That thing is telling you that you're having a heart problem, a heart failure, heart attack. That you need to go and treat yourself. That what is happening to you it has something to do with heart. Number one mango. You know, heart is the number one thing. Number one life. With that heart, nothing can be alive in your body. If your heart died, everything about you will die. That gun that coming out from that fruit, trying to tell you there is problem, there is problem in your heart. You are having a heart attack. Tell me you are you are you are under bondage. You are not comfortable. Either you are taking your medical treatment, your medical treatment. You are on drugs. You may be having high blood high pressure. That is what I think telling you. If breeze blow it and they fall and you pick it, you start seeing gum coming out from the head of that fruit. Check your heart. Check everything about heart. There is problem. Go and treat yourself. Did you see the mango tree? And uh, you are start coming. And that mango, breeze will start. You see breeze blowing that number one mango. Blowing it very heavily. And you, you saw this thing. And you shock and start watching. And none of them foul from none of them foul. He's trying to tell you if you had if you have any business or anything you're doing, your heart is shaking. He's trying to tell you you are not comfortable with the that is with your life. The spirit of fears have occupied you. Your heart is not one place. You are thinking, you are under worries. You are experiencing things. You are under imagi imagination. You are thinking about something. Whether 
you you having double mind with that go forward or stop there is a something that you are battling with through your heart there is a something that convincing you you try to understand you have to pray and say any priest that putting any power that using priest putting confusion in my life putting confusion in my 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 focus my thinking my memory that don't want me to focus and know and follow the full step that will lead me to a, 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 a surviving of my life you have to pray and terminate that powers there are some powers that put in a confusion a spirit of confusion full all over you that is that you see the mango tree the breeze blowing the fruit and they can't fall you are under a bondage. you are under a spell you are under a spirit of confusion you full your all your body full of confusion you have to focus did you see the mango tree and the leaves of the tree very very greenish you see it very fresh greenish and you see a life something like a, 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 a small life the, 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 what did they call it water this water that I used to drop early money you see it it starts coming up you know touching the mango the mango just pure life the greenish is trying to tell you that your health is guaranteed that your health is guaranteed that you are getting well if you are a sick person that's one is telling you that you are getting well you are recovering you are recovering speedily if you are taking treatment continue your treatment if you are praying continue that you are praying that is just trying to tell you there is life you are coming at that tree that fruit that leaves representing you that tree representing you that life shows that the life have come that god have visited you that small small water that has touched it is true that there is that is life have come you life have come pray hard God have visited you, you are viewed in Jesus' name. May this healing be permanent in the name of Father and Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Did you see the mango tree? It's trying to, uh, the, I mean the number one mango. And the one of the breeze blow or thunder caught one of the, uh, this thing. The part and the part, breeze cut it off and the, the part of the tree fell down. You have to pray hard against any spirit of accident. You have to pray hard against any spirit of accident. If there is any power, anything, maybe someone has raised an accident to you. The person that said that you must die through accident. Or you must, you know, you must. Something very, very, this thing will hurt you. You must be hit with shock. You come against every shock, every spirit of accident. Pray as a back to sender that I will not by die with accident. I will not die by accident. Pray this prayer. After prayer, God will visit you. I don't know how you dream of your own seeing a number one mango tree. Please drop your message here by special grace of God. I will interpret it the way you will understand it and it will be meaningful to you. Thank you. My name is uh, Kim Pride Okon. The way about how to solve a dream, you have to go in back on prayer. This prayer is three days. If you can pray, this prayer, if you have, if you, uh, if you, if you, if your feet can carry it, six to six or six to three. Pray three days. And pray, just what you are going to pray is healing. Father God, I need healing. I need focus. Let God heal your heart. Let God heal your soul. Let God heal your spirit. Right? Let God heal everything about you. Pray for healing. And may God restore you back in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. My name is Ken Bright Okono. Please share this broadcast. Share this link. Share this page. And share this my YouTube channel. To others so that people will follow you and you know celebrate with God remember if God bless you put your comments put your comments and say God thank you don't be one of them that eat God's glory may God visit you at the point of your needs in Jesus most precious name amen love you all